On April 30th, 1968, with the war in Vietnam raging, North Vietnamese troops moved to attack U.S. forces operating at the Dong Ha Combat Base in Quang Tri Province of South Vietnam. Throughout the fierce fighting, U.S. Marines stationed there were able to repel the assault and counterattack the North Vietnamese troops at the fortified village of Dai Do. During the battle, Captain J.R. Vargas, the commanding officer of Company G, 2nd Battalion, 4th Marines, 9th Marine Amphibious Brigade, 3rd Marine Division, was wounded by enemy fire while relocating his unit. Captain Vargas fought through the intense pain, continued to display excellent leadership by combining his company with available reserve elements to prepare an assault. He then led his combined force towards the enemy through 700 meters of open rice fields while under intense fire. Throughout the three-day battle, Captain Vargas continued to lead his men in attacking enemy positions, repelling counterattacks, and rendering aid to fellow Marines. When his battalion commander was seriously injured, Captain Vargas, at the great risk to himself, carried his commanding officer to safety. Suffering more wounds, Captain Vargas deferred medical treatment and continued to fight. The Battle of Dai Do was a victory for the United States Marine Corps and resulted in a complete withdrawal of North Vietnamese Army forces from the area. For his gallant actions and exceptional leadership, Captain J.R. Vargas was awarded the Medal of Honor.